now now mine working just one thing cut way not for this always a good set of stairs to get you warmed up I just want to smell. Brother, brother, no, brother, no, come on. Guys, what are you guys doing? Come on, brother, take away. Take away. Oh, what are the music, It's for who? It's for who? What is the security? What is the security? What is the 20 hours. 20 hours. 20 hours, and I'm going to miss everything. Hey, give me. How was that? Good, good. Good. How are you feeling? Good. Yeah? Good? How's Crazy good? week for you? Very tough. Yeah? Everybody tried to smash me. <laughs> a lot of questions. I'll see you out there. Okay? See All see right. You. Bye, guys. See you. Yeah. All right, gang. Let's do it. We're on our way now. People think that Laron Murphy is a, a perfect opponent for you in the sense that this is a fight that's very easy for you to win. Do you agree with that? He's uh, also a good fighter. He's very strong and he's very strong. In any case, he's going to be able to win and win and win. Come on, you two. I'm going to give him a fight. Trust me, I'm going to give him a fight. He's, he's going to be shocked in there, but I'm no run over for anybody. Um, I'm here to stay, I'm here to fight, I'm here to win. I'm excited to be fighting JoJo. She's a tough competitor. I think that we're both gonna collide and we're gonna, you know, it's gonna be fireworks. Hi. Each camp I'm getting better and better and I just feel that's fueling my confidence and... Yeah, I'm just gonna go in there and just do whatever it takes. Thank you, ladies. How do you evaluate the UFC's heavyweight division right now? Because it seems like there's a heavyweight contender ready to shine. Do you agree? Yeah, I think um, they don't give it to DC or Nagano. I think I'm a natural selection, but Chanel's my opponent. That's what I'm worried about. I'm worried about who gets the fight for the title after this. Awesome. Two things forward. Oh, my opponent is pretty good, you know, for sure. He's top 15 guy. So, yeah. It's a big challenge for me. Doesn't matter how I finish him, I knock out him, or I some beat him, doesn't matter. I beat him like easy because he tired after first round. Wow, nice. You're taking on Edson Barboza, which is a rematch. And when you think back to that loss, can you remember how you felt afterwards? I was devastated. I remember uh, I walked backstage, I broke down with my coaches, and, you know, I was, I, I was upset. Um, I was in pain too, it was a tough fight, so I just think about what can I do better? And I let the fear of the things that hurt me in that fight drive me. I can't sleep at night sometimes because I'm thinking about what if he lands this again? What if he does that again? And I feel like those are the best things to happen to a fighter is if you're not uncomfortable or scared of who you're fighting, he's gonna knock you out or he's gonna piece you up, you know what I mean? You can't, you can't disrespect him like that. And I have nothing but respect for Edson and I'm gonna turn that into fuel and go after him. Thank you, John. I train for 15 minutes big war. The last fight, fight of the night you guys imagine on Saturday night. It's gonna be a crazy, be ready, guys. Gosh, do you want me to take Dustin that way? Please. Yeah. You're facing the guy who has a chance to go down as one of the best fighters of all time. You have a chance in two days to be the first man to ever beat him. How are you handling all that? I'm handling well, man. I feel good. And I've been saying it all week. I have a chance to do something great. Champion versus champion. It's a very special point in my career and, and a special point in, in combat sports. It's going to be a, a historic night. Let's talk about this fight. Dustin Poirier, he has said this fight is going to be a dog fight. How would you describe it? Dog fight is gonna be for him, not for me, you know, because I'm gonna dominate in show. And I don't like poster they call us champ versus champ. This is not champ versus champ. I'm the champ, he's interim champ. This is a big difference. Habib gonna smash Dustin, inshallah. And that's it.
Everybody who's not in Betty, go in the room and do your job. Go sleep. Guys, you all good? Yeah. Straight on. I'm getting straight on, yo. Next fight in the lightweight division, one half of the co-main event, Edson Barbosa. Yeah. Oh, you're good. Yep. Good job, man. My time when you back. go 4.15 today, when you go there, he's got your poster. 